Hello, I'm Giles Darling and I write novels, plays and non-fiction books. In this video I read out loud a short story or text that I wrote as homework for a writing group that I go to. If you're interested, there's more information in this video's description below. But first, please feel free to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Just a couple of clicks, it costs nothing and it's free. Also, when you've finished watching this video, please check out the rest of my channel, especially where I talk about the various books that I've written. I hope my channel encourages you to buy my books, available on Amazon, see the link below, and to read them if you haven't already done so. What's more, every so often, the ebook versions can be downloaded for free. Now let's get back to the video. On this occasion, the prompt was write something containing the words Sky Horse. As some background context, this text was written in January, although I don't know which year. This is what I wrote. As the days grow longer once more, my thoughts return to a crisp January evening when I was a small boy. My heartbeat quickens as I recall staying up past my bedtime and hurrying with my family across a field full of parked cars towards a circus big top with the words All Equine Circus painted on it. The smell of hay enveloped us as we took our seats among hundreds of eager spectators. Soon the show started. There were the usual acts like horses balancing on balls, jumping through flaming hoops and forming a pyramid. The horse clowns and their collapsing carriage raised some laughs. Finally came the highlight, what we'd all been waiting for, the trapeze act. The crowd oohed and aahed as a horse flew gracefully through the air from one swinging horizontal bar to another. This was no ordinary horse. This was the Sky Horse. Years later, the Sky Horse retired to a field by the New Forest, but she jumped or somersaulted over fences that were increased in height after each attempted escape. Then she taught the other horses to form a pyramid, which she used to flee forever. No one knows what became of the Sky Horse. Rumours spread. Occasional overseas sightings were always eventually found to be false. But if you're driving through the New Forest and you spot a wild horse swinging from tree to tree, or maybe performing somersaults or pirouettes by the roadside, it's probably a descendant of the Sky Horse. The end. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. I always have fun planning and writing them. What would you have written if faced with the same prompt? Is there anything you would have changed or added, bearing in mind the limited word count? If so, please feel free to add your comments below. Also, if you like my writing style, perhaps you'd enjoy reading my novels and plays too. They're often similar in tone. Before you go, please don't forget to like and subscribe this video on my YouTube channel and to buy and read my books, available on Amazon, see the link below if you haven't already done so. Thanks for watching. Come back soon.